Hey everyone, welcome to a new video where I'll show you how to summon the witch boss in the Girthy mod. Basically, you'll need to find a structure called the Girthy Blight Shack. It's a house that usually spawns in swamps, so head to a swampy area. Inside, it's pretty basic with different levels and structures. There are chests, a cursed cage and a pedestal. Probably the best loot in the house, that's about it. As for mod related stuff, there's not much. I don't get why Gertie structures don't drop more mod specific loot. Instead of junk and books, why not drop mod enchantments? No disrespect to the creator, but the structures seem pointless. However, this structure has a small crystal ball that spawns a witch when you interact with it. Right click it and a witch will appear. She's a boss, so be careful. Let's use cheats so you can see how it works. This isn't a tutorial on defeating her, but let's check it out. I'll eat an enchanted apple, use a netherite sword and armor and find her. She'll probably spawn outside. Here she is. Her name is Ethna Witch. There we go. Oh no, it's Aunt Ethna. Besides poison attacks, which you can counter, she has thorns. Remember that. I want you to know this. We'll need to gradually reduce her health. You can't see much right now. I'll use effect clear. As you can see, she can freeze me too. She's a max level witch. There's her health bar. Now she's burned me and so on. The girl teleports gradually, dealing massive damage as you can see. I'm not sure how far you can run from her. It seems you can outrun her quite a bit. In other words, you can escape fairly well. I'd like to see if arrows can damage her, or if she just teleports away. You can indeed harm her with arrows too. But as I said, she's pretty tough. Remember, we have the dark one to use any focus, like an electric focus for example. Ice storm, let's try this one out. And blast this mob a bit, that's another way to do it. The undead is acting a bit silly. For some reason, it, it took off my chest plate, so that's basically how it works. As you can see, it can regenerate, so be careful. I'll kill it in creative to show you the staff. Perfect. As you can see, using a Shardnet 5 sword, there shouldn't be much trouble killing it. And this is basically the staff. It drops a crown hat, giving a 25% chance not to consume a potion when drinking. The treasure pouch, when opened, gives these kinds of minor loot items. Maybe some jade, but I'm not too concerned about the loot, honestly. An enchanted book and witch's loot. That's how we can find this mob, and how to kill it. Not much else to say, hope you enjoyed it. The coolest part is definitely the smiling doors. Pretty creepy, I think it's the best detail overall. That's it, subscribe and see you in future videos.